Da Vinci if you don't stop it. So here's why I never leave these guys unsupervised. They play all the time. When there's food or toys involved, they get very, very territorial. Um, sometimes they even hang out all night long. And I see a side to Da Vinci that I never see. Like he's most of the time really sweet, very calm. But he is so wired up over this bone that he's ready to have a whole fight with um, McAllen. And like I said, if you leave them unsupervised and you're in the house doing something and they're out here, and you think they're okay, and they get a hold of something and you don't even know that they got, I mean, this is one of their bones and you're not here to monitor what's going on between them. You can really have a, a pretty bad catastrophe. And like I said, you can't really go off of how they normally react because I would have never thought that um, that I would have saw what I just saw just now. You know, they're a day apart. They're both um, approaching five months, still puppies. Play all the time, hang out all the time. They take their potty breaks together. Um, but today, obviously, is an exception to the rule. So, somebody's usually always out here with them. You know, if they come out, someone supervises them on top of you know, the security that's out here with them. Never left alone. And as you can see, that's not a bad thing at all. Got plenty of space, plenty of room. They can stay out of each other's way, but obviously they're gonna find a way to get in, in each other's way. Major, you know, he just kinda hangs out here. Um, it's a big old baby. You know, too much deal with, um, you know, too much deal with Da Vinci or McAllen. He ain't gonna do too much running around. He'll either sit by me or get on place for a while and work for food and treats. That kind of thing. They all have their own little personalities. Every last one of them. But like I said, I'm seeing a side to Da Vinci that, that I don't normally see. So you got that bone. I'm in DaVinci. They ain't even trying to hear me. Gotta get some more control going. Bone, girl in heat. He should always be able to listen to my command regardless of what's going on in his life. So definitely gotta get some more, some better control over him. 
Come here, McAllen. Come. Yeah, he does well, but wait a minute, I don't want you jumping in my lap. He don't have a bone either, though. Major does well. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Tight for real, boy. Tight for real. McAllen is a uh, the Isabella stud. I think I'm a stud. So is Major. I gotta get him out of his little baby zone, though. He's just a big old baby. Just a big old baby. Big baby. Come here to bench you. Benji, come here. Come. I have a talk with him after this video. He is not paying attention to anything. Everything blue. That's greedy stuff. Come on, Major, let it go. Do not play with me. Stop. Go. All right, guys. I'm getting off of here. Just a glimpse of the inside of my world at York of Boston. Tune in next time.